Okay guys, so this is Eva's hair. Look how long it is. Okay guys, we've got 10 minutes till my appointment. We've come early because I feel like I needed to take like a moment. But, oh. I feel like I'm excited but I'm like antsy. It's such a big change and I think I'm gonna cut it to like here. So it's gonna be so much shorter. Alan's very excited because he's he says my hair is far too long, which yeah. it is definitely too long. I was due to get a haircut in September and then I decided to grow it longer and donate it. So I reckon I could donate about 12 inches. Do you think or more? Yeah. I don't know, yeah, 12 inches, yeah. yeah. That's have good. you brought your um, zip block bag? Yes. I have, good, yeah. Good, good. So I have to put my hair in like <clears throat> sandwich bags. So I've got those in my handbag and then I send it off to the Little Princess Trust. The Little Princess Trust ask for seven inches of hair. If you think about it, that's really not much and I think I will be growing it again, even if it's just seven inches and then chopping it short again. Um, I think that this is a process I would definitely do again in the future because it's so easy to cut your hair and donate it. All you have to do, as I said, is donate minimum seven inches of hair, put it in a Ziploc bag and post it to them. It's that easy and they say that you should shampoo your hair but not condition it so that's what I did last night I've washed it I haven't put conditioner in it so yeah they're just gonna braid it and chop it Woo! I think you're delirious. I think I'm delirious, like I'm really giddy, I can't stop talking and I'm like not with it. It's a huge change, it's gonna take time to get used to, but I really like it, I think. At the moment I don't feel like this is me, I feel very light. I've had long hair for a very long time guys. Um, let me show you the ponytail as well. So that used to be here. Hmm. That's crazy, right? Yep. I'm delirious right now. So my hair is being donated to children who have lost their hair to cancer. It's such a great cause and it's really exciting. I think I'm in a little bit of shock because my hair is very short compared to what I'm used to. But it's for a really good cause. So I'm really happy I've done this. I would highly recommend you guys growing your hair to donate it. And if you want to support me cutting off all of this hair, please, please, please give, do give a donation to Cancer Research UK. I've got the link, all of the details in the description box below. It would mean so much to me and to the charity. It really is a fantastic charity. Cancer is something that affects all of us, whether it's going to be yourself personally or through someone you love. So it's really important that we join together with this. Just donate one pound, five pounds, whatever you feel like. As I said earlier, it's international, so it doesn't matter where you're based in the world, you can donate. It takes three minutes. I believe if you're doing it on the computer, you can even pay through PayPal. And now it's starting to rain, so we're going to have to go inside quickly and get shelter. I'm going to be sending off my hair to the Little Princess Trust and it just feels so weird that I'm holding my hair in my hand. Like, that's just so weird. But anyway, I'm going to call it a day here, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing me cut off my hair for charity, I hope it inspires you to do the same. Okay, guys, I just realised I forgot to tell you guys which hairdresser I went to and who I saw. But I'm really liking my hair. Like, I really like it. Also, if you guys have been following me for a while, you know I love Jackie Kennedy. And I feel like this is, like, can be messy and edgy, but it's still got that kind of, like, cool vibe to it and I feel like it's just reminding me of Jackie Kennedy and I love her. Okay so now that I've kind of thought about it I thought maybe you guys would be interested in going to the same hairdressers if you're in London. So I went to Larry King in South Kensington. I highly highly recommend it. I used to go to like Tony and Guy and also Taylor Taylor in Liberty which are also good salons and good hairdressers but for me this was like on another level because it was such a transformation and they were really supportive and kind in there and it was just such a positive experience. So I saw Rachel and she was amazing, like you can see it's so cool. 
and it's got like texturizing spray in it at the moment i'm just being so vain looking at myself in the monitor but see like i can mess it around and i still think it looks like really cool so i'm really happy with how it came out and yeah i really recommend going to larry king if you want to see them okay now i'm going to call it an end here i'm going to kind of like take it in a bit longer and eat some lunch because that took that took two hours guys you wouldn't think it but doing a whole hairstyle revamp really took quite a long time but yeah really recommend larry king it was a great experience i hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did don't forget to do donate to cancer research uk i really really hope you guys do because it is an amazing charity and i will see you very soon